My name is Frank, Frank Eggman, nicknamed Swiss Frank. I represent my wonderful country of Switzerland and the Consul General here in Lagos. It's not every day, meaning innovation comes into being when there is a need and when there is a real meaning in what you want to do. And that doesn't happen every day. And maybe philosophically speaking, it doesn't need to be always innovation. It's also good to look back, to go back to traditional things and to ponder about are we going in the right direction when we do innovation, when we talk about innovation. So it's not, it's not an everyday thing, you know? It should be taken with cautiously and when needed. Sometimes situations, but also location. In a place, you can use it, it makes sense. And a few kilometers away, with a different community, it doesn't make any sense, you know? Why are you insisting on that side when it's the other party that needs it? So, so balance it. It's not, everything is not about innovation. It's a lot about human being, human capital. There are people behind that, not just technology. I don't think that Nigeria needs that spirit because uh, since I'm here, I've discovered Nigeria as a very uh, inspired and inspiring country with great brains and fast moving people that challenge the system and the things that are established. So I'm not here to compare, you know, between countries. As I said, a side has different needs. We have different needs. Of course, Switzerland is the most innovative country in the world for the 13th consecutive year. That is due to the education. 70% of our young people don't go to university. They do vocational training, hands-on, creativity. That, that's part of their DNA from small on into education. It's not about learning and ticking the right box. It's about trying, failing, succeeding. My advice to Nigeria as a country and to the Nigerian people, just keep on doing what you do. You are awesome in what you do. And my job is to try to get Swiss entrepreneurs that come with a different mindset, with other background, with other ideas. And we are trying to set up delegations to come here and to, yeah, 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 to, into Lagos primarily, to tap into those resources, into those ideas, this is where things are happening. So my advice, don't change, just go ahead, continue, insist, you know, because you guys are good at it. Good ideas will spread around. Huh? When a product or an idea or a technology becomes successful, it becomes visible, it becomes desirable. And then the next state will have a look at it, Port Harker will come and say, hey, we need that tool, we want to implement it. So basically, there is no secret formula to say you should go from A to B, continue what you're doing. The moment you become visible, I'm sure people had, have adopted Netflix in all the other states. Yes, yes, well, yes, yes. because it's, uh, you have it, they have it, no? So if you come with a good product and good solution, the other will adhere, they will want to have it. So we should just give it time. I think we do the same in Switzerland. We are a small landlocked country. And once uh, our product is successful, the Germans come over the border and say, can we have a look at it? Can we try with you? Then the French want to translate it into their language, the Italian, the UK, and then it spreads around, you know? It's not your job to go and marketing abroad. Do what you are good at, develop it, and then make it seen. You know, like evenings, like tonight, uh, fantastic platforms to showcase, you know, the excellency of certain technologies and then uh, get around and talk to people, yeah?